So this is the iPhone 8 Plus and this is the portrait mode. I love using the portrait mode of this oh, phone. So yeah. if you love taking photos of your son using portrait mode, again, the iPhone 8 Plus is a great beep, deal. Beep. Yes, Anna. Yeah. Can I take a photo first? Please. 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 guys what's up welcome again to another video this is my iphone 8 plus my main driver and this is my wife's iphone 10s now the iphone 10s will be discontinued and the iphone 8 plus will have a price drop and this is now currently the most cheapest available iphone 450 dollars and that is not bad for the price should you consider buying the 10r my problem with the 10r is the portrait mode only captures a human being it doesn't capture a sneaker a tech or a mug that you love so it is not that worth it since I love the portrait mode and I want to capture my sneakers my gadgets or my outfit of the day so go check out my Instagram and check my profile which is fresh PH Manila so there you go let's talk about this $450 40,000 pesos Starting price currently right now when you check out the website the Apple store They have the price 64 gig capacity not that bad because when I bought this last year It is 55,000 pesos and yes, I love the overall belt However, it may not be like the way it looks like this one as you can see you can tell the difference So there is this notch the camera so what makes this not like the iPhone successes that you can tell it does have the dual camera so is it worth it for the price if you're considering upgrading from your iPhone 6 iPhone 7 should you consider buying the iPhone 8 plus for me it's not that bad for the price it captures great photos so definitely it's a good phone so, should you buy also the iPhone XS? I don't think so because it doesn't have a price drop. Just go with the 11 and the 11 Pro. So, there you go guys. And I'm very happy that they released the iPhone 11 considering they are also now leveling the game on other smartphone devices. They are mid-tier phones and they are really good for the price. And Apple is considering the consumers in mind that's why, yes, they are doing a price drop. And for me, this is totally worth it, guys. The iPhone 8 Plus for 40,000 pesos, if you want an upgrade and you don't want to spend that much, this is a great phone for 2019. If you don't want to spend or you have that limit, go with it. Thank you guys for watching the video. I hope you like it. Don't forget to hit that like button and see you in another video.